Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting going to episode 7 and 8 of Saki. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 7 in 3, 2, 1, go. Now see, this is going to be completely different because remember, she's been playing with Saki. So her skills right now, they're going to be even more top tier. Thank She is. <laughs>
In a way, but is it working though? There's a reason why she's doing that. She would be falling asleep at a time like this. It's because she ain't got any tacos. She hasn't had tacos in a couple of minutes. See, I told you because now. <laughs> Cause now her ass up for the damn time. <laughs> Okay, I mean, even if she doesn't stand out right now, she's scoping and waiting her turn until she can overpower them. She doesn't always need to use her overpowering moves first because that's what really messes her up in the end. Come back in my ass, just watch. Penguin is the best thing about her. Baby, it's just ranking up. Oh, they did.
Yeah, I mean, because in a way, no offense, it just seems like now the other three are really trying. Like, yes, not a not a god. She's gonna give her all regardless. But yeah, she's right. No one can match her speed. What's it? Game set match, even though it's ain't tennis. I feel like everybody's like, you know what? We should just give up and let them win. I'm like, damn. <laughs> the penguin. <laughs> Definitely the penguin. Well, um, but it's true though. Yeah, it's not easy. A sandwich would just take out and look at everything. Tacos probably just had a horde of tacos. That's good though. It would have been better if we actually got to say that. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I get it. You gotta say it though. Gotta go like get the fuck away from me. Yeah, I'm 
You are right. <laughs> That's so fucked up. <laughs> They said, everybody said, nah, we already know how it's going to go with this group, so let's just go watch everybody else. That's so mean. I mean, yeah, you can't be mad at her. Damn. Oh, so you're one of those, huh? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? Of course. You know what I kind of thought they were going to do was, since we were officially in the second round, skip and just immediately go into the final, but they could, oh damn, oh. would get distracted by that no sir Excuse me. Uh. 
So if she's proud of her, that's a win. You don't need to sit there and abuse them. Okay, let me say something real quick. What if that's Saki's sister? But at the same time, I don't think so. I just feel like she's just someone who, of course, is on top and just wants to beat this shit out of these girls, which is sad. Because that's all they want. It's a revenge story. Okay, hold up. Is she fi Oh, she finally opening her other eye. Okay, because like for the last couple of episodes, I'm like, what the fuck is with her and having one eye open, one eye closed? And I was like, I'm guessing we're going to get something on it soon, but we ain't getting that till next week. All right. So all I'm going to say about this, see, okay. I love that we got to see Nautica, you know, in action for her little, what, 10 minute piece but dislike that we didn't really get to see Saki, but we all knew that Saki was going to win in the end. But it still would have been nice to see her match. But I get it. It's a 23-minute episode. So once again, you can't have everything that you truly want in it. Their coach is a bitch. Why would you sit there and abuse them? It's ridiculous. Like, once again, kids... Whatever. I I, mm, I take a stick. I, I draw the line at that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That that's a little too much. Like mm -mm. that's not cool. No 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 no. But the fact is that they are now in the finals with that other group and several other groups. These girls can get the revenge on the fact that they lost the year prior to. And who knows how that is gonna go for them? I, look at these two. Married. Officially. I just want her to open the eye again. Because something tells me we're not truly going to see what her eye looks like until about episode 9, 10 ish. Because this girl, that, it's got to be like her secret weapon or some shit, right? Because why would you have one eye open and one eye closed? So, you know, for Naruka, her, her penguin is her secret weapon. And them inspecting it was cute sell too because they're like, hey, we got to make sure this girl ain't cheating, yada, yada, yada. I'm going to get it because, you know, that's what they have to do. That's their job and make sure that nothing is wrong. And so the fact that she was still able to use the penguin and still win, best girl. Once again. Mm -hmm. Best girl material. Yes. <laughs> but go ahead and pause the video. And I will see you guys in one second for episode eight. Alrighty. Episode eight in three, two, one, go. Wait, nope. Three, two, one, go. There you go. It's crazy that they all gotta go like back home and ish. They couldn't all just get hotels. 
I mean, it's, oh, I mean, especially because, you know, this is a tournament. You think the tournament would provide these schools hotels. Sometimes, not all the time. But th this is the one moment. One moment where they don't provide them with that. They're like, hey, you came here on your home. You're going home on your own. Excuse me. Last thing. But we did Adesha. I don't know how the hell we did it. But we made it through those three hours. And now I gotta get ready to edit all these videos. And then I'm going to bed. I'm so sleepy. And normally. I'm normally not sleepy at this time. I'm normally sleepy at least like 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. And something tells me. I'm still going to bed at 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. I always freaking do. Tacos. Always hungry. <laughs> it's taco. Oh, octopus! Okay. Eat her stomach is secretly a black hole. She is like the Kirby of this show. She is just always eating and eating and eating and she can never, ever, you know, satisfy her hunger. <laughs> Yeah, but still, wouldn't it have just been better to stay at a hotel near where the tournament is? Like, that's so much money going from a sub for, for take a train. I can't speak. But seriously, that's too much money. Can you imagine in U.S. dollars how much that would be? Girl. And plus, then everybody has to pitch in unless the tournament would be like, no, you don't have to pay for anything. Yeah, um, girls, I hate y'all, coach.
You think she would also say, as the captain of the group <laughs> and the student council president, and you know, everybody be like, hey, please text when you get home. Exactly. And so we know how bad you want it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Of course she's serious. Oh, damn. You okay? Oh my god, stop. Always comes in to ruin his fantasies, and I love it.
Oh, baby, you still have a chance to fulfill that wish. But she, she just wants to make sure. These two are going to come so late. <laughs> You should all do something or a bear. She's sweet, and I love how she, you know, gets to have moments with each of them and talking to basically better themselves. But at the same time, you do feel bad for her because if they do lose, they can't continue on. So this is everything for them. Everything, every little training montage, whatever they've done, is leading up to this moment for them. And they need this. I hold the computer to go haywire. 
Did you press something? Did you spill? And this one. <laughs> Sleeping. <laughs> Co Benny vibes. <laughs> Everybody got their damn secret weapons. Jesus Christ. In the fireflies yeah. with your girlfriend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's coming to figure out. They're so cute. All right, let's kick some ass today. Damn, hold on, wait, 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 wait. I thought that we were getting the same ending that I got in episode seven. Y'all really said nah. That's a little fucked up because I really like that ending. I thought it was really cute because, yes, it suited them because it was about Saki and Nadoka. Like, come on. It was right. But this next two, these next two episodes, 9 and 10, it's about to be a bloodbath in the Mahjong tournaments and such. A certain amount of, like, okay, here, here's my big thing. 
how many groups can go to nationals? I mean, there has to be like, what, at least four? And we have how many groups left? Like, mm, some people's hearts gonna be broken in this in these next two episodes I'm about to watch in a couple of days. And honestly, it is going to be sad to see because you don't want anyone to lose. It, it, it's, it hurts. It really, truly hurts to lose or just anything because especially like as someone who used to play um basketball in middle school i i'm okay with losing but i had a um i cannot believe i'm about to talk about this person um i had a teammate that was very bitchy and hated freaking hated when we lost Hell, it even got worse when when um we switched like freaking uh coaches and went from one coach together and the coach the second coach that we got was her dad. Mm -hmm. Like mm, it's been so many years later. I'm not as like I'm not really bitter with that, but like you know how like sometimes you get like triggered and such. Oh my god, yes, like uh. But yeah, I think next week will be really interesting for all these groups that are going into the finals of this tournament. This is literally going to make or break whoever wins and loses. They're going to, like, regardless, whatever the results is next week, everybody is still going to come out of this, like, still as winners, but at the same, they're going to win something and they're going to lose something at the same time, whether that is a teammate or anything you feel for him truly like once again we about to break some hearts next week like oof but other than that guys that is my reaction for you towards episode seven and eight of Saki. if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day join the Russian squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next Saturday for Patreons, and next Monday for everybody else for episodes 9 and 10. Bye, guys!